Welcome to Wednesday night's NBA action here on 2K Sports. Hi, everyone. I'm Brian Anderson, along with Grant Hill and Brent Berry, our distinguished analysts. Allie LaForce on the sidelines. It's the Chicago Bulls taking on the Washington Wizards. And so off the tip, it's Washington. And now the opening lineup for Chicago. Pass to Arenas. Launches it. Nice start for him. Sinking his first shot. He's consistent from out there. Especially when you give him that kind of room. And here's Jordan. Here's Pippen. That's tipped. That's going to be over and back. Not watching the line on that one. Possession to the Bulls. And so here is Chicago. It's a three-point game. Pass to Harper. To the middle. Jordan with the bucket. The defensive effort was lacking a bit, but hey, give them credit for finding a weakness there. Just really smart basketball and exploiting whatever holes that he's seeing right now in the defensive squad. Here's Jamison. Over to the left wing. Six to shoot. Fades away. It's wide right. Hits off the rim. Well, he wanted to keep that shot from getting blocked, but in the process, he gave it no chance of going in because of how unbalanced he was on the fade. When you're trying to stop a guy like this, you have to match his intensity level. Pass to Butler. To the left side wing. Here's Arenas. Oh, and they immediately answer back with a dunk on the other end. Now that's how you capitalize on a screen. Yeah, good positioning, too. Gave him a clear path to the hoop. Really not enough help there. Lack of communication on the backside. Outside Butler. Knocked loose. Out of bounds. Wizards ball as Washington yeah. keeps possession. Ball. An outstanding defensive play to earn the mobile one block. And that kind of rejection early on energizes your squad. The coaching staff just loves this kind of hustle. Hey, come on, come on, come on. So it's Washington now. Here's Jamison. Clock at six. From deep three-point range, Washington gets it back. Haywood. And the dunk to finish it off. A oh, beauty. <laughs> and this is something he does all too well. Great position for the putback there. And I like how he doesn't think twice about passing it out. Just going right for the slam. Well, his competitiveness right now is why the teammates love him. Here's Arenas. Five points in the game. Let's it fly. Off the left rim and out. Well, mid-range is where he makes the money. So when the D's slow to get out on him, always surprising to see him miss from there. Pass to Harper. Here's Pippen. Here's Harper. From deep. Deflected. Here's Haywood. That shot off. Now Chicago takes it the other way. Here's Harper. He takes it in. Here's Longley. Second chance shot. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Heady play to stop that easy foul. layup right there. I mean, make him earn it at the line. At the line for the Bulls. Lou Longley. At the line for two. Two. 
That one's off. And he's good on the second. First quarter of action, just under three and a half minutes played. Here's Stevenson. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. Here's Pippen. Butler covering. Knocked away. Here's Arenas. He's got five. Doesn't go for him. Some solid defense from Jordan. He got a piece of it. Here's Stevenson. Rodman with a rebound. Chicago trailing here. Pass to Pippen. Here's Harper. To the paint. Here's Jordan. They get it back. It's good on the putback. He really gets in perfect position for the follow. Just a terrific read. Here's Arenas. Here's Haywood. And it falls. Two for three from the field so far. Pounding it inside early and often. Setting a physical tone. Here's Harper. Washington with a rebound. Well, he's not very hard to defend right now. This is when the defense might step back and let him try to find his range. Pass to Stevenson. Outside Butler. Shot clock at six. And it's good with time running down on the shot clock. Now, what a great option he gives them on every possession. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rough stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. Jordan misses. I know he's on a cold streak, but he can't let that get in his head. Especially if you're a player that doesn't get a lot of shot attempts. But otherwise, the mindset is, I just got to get the next one to go. And you don't want to put that much pressure on yourself. Well, his shooting has been a little bit below par. You think about what this lead would look like if he was on. Oh, man. Talk about hang time. What a wicked double clutch finish. Hey, when you have that kind of space, you're allowed to get fancy. Here's Stevenson. Now quiet so far offensively. Searching for his first points of the game. Butler on the wing. Over Jordan. And it's Washington with another. I just don't think they want him taking that kind of shot. Again, his teammates are just laughing, shaking their heads there on the bench. Pass to Jordan. Tried to bank it in, but it misses. I love how they've attacked the boards here in the first quarter. Here's Stevenson. He can't hit that time. Some solid defense from Jordan. Here's Pippen. Butler covering. Fires from the line. Pippen, no good. The Wizards with a lead. Here's Arenas. Five points in the game. Puts it up from 12. Here's Haywood. And count that. Two points and a chance for one more at the line. Such a big part of what he does for this team. Just work and work on the boards. Generate second chance opportunities. And hopefully convert. First team foul. At the line for Washington. the line for one. One shot.
And the free throw, no good. Chicago with the ball. They trail by six. Pass to Jordan. Yeah, that one's good. Jordan's got eight points. And you like the balance here. Not just falling in love with the three ball. Here's Haywood. Here's Daniels. Second shot opportunity. Here's Haywood. Good efficiency. He's drained four out of five. He got in excellent position, then takes it right back up. Pass to Rodman. Jordan inside. Off target with a jump hook. Jordan's gotten only four of his 11 shots to fall here so far. Here's Daniels. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. And he lays it up and in. And now an eight-point wizard lead. They're punishing those late defensive rotations, getting good looks inside throughout the half. Pass to Rodman. Here's Kukoc. Washington with a rebound. Butler's got four rebounds now. Here's Daniels. Driving in. And he dunks it down. So far, they're owning both ends of the floor. We'll see if they can keep this going. Like tonight, that all the hustle plays have meant so much to this team. Now just sustain some of that energy and keep comfortable. And now let's revisit that exceptional mobile one block. You know, you can't ask for any better defense than that. He responded so fast to the shooter, and it stifled him. Here's Kerr. Drops in the three. Kerr. No way he's going to pass that shot. Up. He is way too far back and relaxed in getting out on it. Pass to Daniels. And here's Butler. From behind the arc. Kept alive. Thomas misses. And he gets a lot of points right there at the rim, but the defense determined not to give up the easy deuce there. Two minutes. Two minutes remaining. Pass to Kukoc. Quarter. Two minutes. A minute 53 left in the first quarter of the game. Four, three, and again, it's oh, Chicago with a three. Backing up that last three with another three. The defense has to stop giving them so many clean looks. Outside Butler from downtown. Rodman with a rebound. Chicago trailing here. Here's Kukoc. One sixteen left to play in the first. Oh, they get a hand on it. Butler with a steal. From 18 feet away. That one a little long. Butler's gone 2 of 5 tonight. Here's Kukoc. Lays it up and banks it in. And now just a two-point Washington lead. And what's working here? Each guy is willing to make the next pass. There's 47 seconds left in the first quarter. Daniels misses. There's a little bit of pressure on him, but not enough to cause him to miss a shot that's in that close. Trying to get back on track. That one is off. Now Chicago takes it the other way. Here's Kukoc. Five points in the game. Butler with a steal. Daniels misses. Down low. And he caught that pass in full stride on his way to the big slam. Not getting old here. Seeing him make that lead pass with perfect timing. Here's Daniels. He buries it from three. He's got seven. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. 
Green, Antonio Samuel. Coming onto the floor for the Bulls, Dickie Simpson. One quarter in the books, and it's been a close one. Wizards out in front, up three. Let's take a quick break, and then it's on to the second quarter after this. through the first quarter. We'll see what happens here in the second. And a look at how the hustle game has been going for the Wizards. Their frenetic defense has been impressive, putting ball handlers on the defensive and turning them over as well. On top of all that, they've done a good job of making life difficult for the opposing shooters. They've had hands up and have contested a lot of shots. Look at the blocks. We've got Butler, and it's Mason in a two-guard. That's the group for Washington right now. Here's Kukoc. Oh, it's blocked! It deflects off the backboard. Six on the shot clock. Here he goes. Another shot. Jamison grabs the board. The Wizards with a lead. Here's Daniels. Second chance effort. This is the layup. And he's doing things on the glass tonight that we don't often see. Well, this kind of effort will energize the team and get you going, just gobbling up every board. Here's Bushler. Here's Kukoc. Over Butler. And again, no good by Chicago. Time for some consideration in the passing category, maybe, Kevin. The shot is just not on. Get somebody else going. Daniels misses. Here's Kukoc. Butler covering. Pass to Kerr. Here's Bushler. Here's Kukoc. Seven points in the game. Hook loose. Second quarter basketball. Just over a minute and a half played so far. And it's going to be a three-second three. call. That's a three-second violation. Chicago ball. Close substitution. Scotty Pippen. Here's Kerr. Pass to Bushler. Here's Kerr. And it's Thomas with the rebound. Here's Daniels. Seven points in the game. Here's Thomas. And he throws it down with one hand. Nice one-handed jam. Simple and effective, B.A. Hey, with the lead, I'm surprised he didn't come up with something a little more creative. Pass to Kukoc. Here's Bushler. Three-pointer. Gets the three to fall. Good heads-up basketball. Season opening and capitalizes. And the Wizards with possession here. They've led by as much as ten. The ball's knocked loose. Here's Daniels. Shot clock at six. The Wizards need to get off a shot here. Here's Mason. No good that time. Now Chicago takes it the other way. Gotta love how they've been crashing the boards, fighting hard for every miss. Pass to Kerr. With the drive. Oh, he missed that one. One for three in this one so far. And here in the second quarter of action, as we approach four minutes played, a nice shot by Butler. 
Butler's got six. Hey, they're just getting pushed around inside. Here's Kerr. Here's Butler. Here's Jamison. And it's good. First made shot in four attempts. A stronger defensive presence would have saved them two points. It didn't seem like anybody was really aware there to go and collect that rebound in the possession. Here's Kerr. High arcing shot. And the layup is good. Five points in the game. When the player gets a feel for that floater, it can really make things tough on defenders. You're just not sure how to guard them and where your point of commitment is. Here's Jamison from six feet away. The rebound by Kukoc. Chicago trailing here. Here's Bushler. Rebounded by Butler. Butler's got five rebounds in the game. It's hauled in by the Bulls. They are so close to taking the lead. This is one of those games where momentum is key. Here's Kukoc. Seven points in the game. And counted. Now four for nine. Now they're playing working to perfection there if that was their plan. And if it wasn't, maybe that should be their plan. Now a timeout, timeout call called by four. Washington. Washington and as we head into this break, the players have an opportunity to replenish their energy with Gatorade as they prepare to go into the final stages of this ballgame. Absolutely. Over the course of a game, not to mention over the course of a season, you have to stay hydrated. If you don't, it's amazing how much slower your body is to bounce back. It can have a serious effect on performance, no question. And the Wizards with possession here. Mason, no good. Pass to Harper. Here's Pippen. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Five to shoot. Here's Kerr. And so it looks like the Bulls will retain possession here. And Chicago has possession. They've only given up six here in this quarter. Here's Stevenson. Pass to Arenas. Here's Stevenson. This one for three. That's good. His first made shot in three attempts. You gotta try to scramble the Jets right here and get that guy off the sweet spot. That's one of the best three-point shooters in the league. Here's Pippen. There's the block. And so it looks like the Bulls will retain possession here. Coming on to the floor for the Bulls. Bill Wennington. Michael Jordan. Here's Pippen. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. Misses off the left iron. Some of it's good defense, and some of it's just poor shot selection. Either way, he's being shut out. <laughs> Attacking the rim with power. Tremendous finish. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. As to Wellington. Now here's Jordan. Fader on the way, and his fifth make of the game in 12 attempts. No one there to contest. Didn't really need the fade. Here's Mason. Here's Arenas. 
Pass to Stevenson. Just three to shoot. Got a piece of it. Here's Pippen. To the right side. And here's Jordan. Let's it go from deep. And Arenas pulls it down. Here's the break. Here's Stevenson. Blocked! Here's Harper. He drives in. And once Harper. he gets to the rim, it's fairly automatic. Nothing fancy right there. Just takes his two points, moves on. Pass to Arenas. Here's Stevenson, six to shoot. Here's Jamison, tipped, and another shot. Here's Arenas, five points in the game. Well, it was only a matter of time before they finally get the bucket. Clearly defensive miscue there. If there's not a body on him that's sitting at the mid-range, that's a defensive mistake. Here's Pippen. It's a five-point game. Pass to Arenas. Inside. Here's Jamison. Oh, and he brings it down with a two-handed jam. And that's what happens when you don't take care of the ball. Hey, that makes the turnover hurt even more. And the gamble paying off. Here's Wennington. Here's Harper. From deep, Jordan drains the triple. Jordan's got five points in the quarter. Gotta D him up better than that. He's simply too good from beyond the arc. Here's Arenas. Seven points in the game. Two minutes. Two minutes remaining in the second. Pass to Thomas. Here's Arenas. Four on the clock. And is blocked. Fast break. Here we go. One forty-four left to play in the half. Now here's Jordan. He's got thirteen. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That's his first person. Oh, man, the defender really went after him. Shooting for Chicago. Michael Jordan. Two shots. Two shots. That's on the first. He throws good. Jordan. Both teams deciding to change it up. Both free throws good for Jordan. The Wizards with a lead. Here's Arenas. He has seven. Pass to Mason. We've got 123 left in the half. And he gets the bucket. He's got 10. He kept his cool despite the double team and finds the open man. Here's Pippen. Now Jordan. He's got 15. Pass to Harper. Five on the clock. With some arc. Good work there as it goes. Harper. Looks like he's getting warmed up. Much better efficiency here in the second quarter. Here's Mason. Here's Arenas, making his mark again. He's shooting four for nine in this one. Defensively, they've got to get more bodies in the paint. That's three straight field goals from below the free throw line. Now 
here's Jordan. He's closely guarded. Pass to Pippen. To the wing, right side. Here's Wennington. Here's Harper. That's short off the rim. Here's Mason. It's stolen. With one on the clock. No good. Misses at the buzzer. And we're through the first half of play here in what's been a good one. Wizards out in front, up by four. And don't go away. After the break, we'll see you right back here for the start of quarter number three. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, welcome back to the NBA on 2K Sports. This is Ernie Johnson. Kenny the Jet Smith is right here. Say hey to the folks, Kenny. Hey, folks. Say hey to the folks, folks, Shaq. Hey, folks. folks. Hey, let's get this party started. A pretty close game for the Wizards throughout the first quarter. The period came to a close with them holding a three-point lead. In the second quarter, they put in the work to create a slight scoring advantage. And let's get your thoughts, Kenny, on the Wizards. It's been an aggressive approach for them at the offensive end. Getting the ball inside and getting as many points as possible close to the rim. So far, so good. They have a nice edge in the points in the paint. How about you, Shaq? What did you think about Chicago? They've done a few things really well, but they're also giving away some opportunities. Turnovers are the main thing they need to do. I'm sure that's their halftime talk. It's taking control. And that's going to do it for us here. The second half of action is coming your way. We've got second half action for you. Thus far, a pretty evenly contested game. Chicago trailing here. And so in the game for the Bulls. Jordan with it. Pass to Pippen. Here's Longley. Shot clock at five. Washington with a rebound. Butler's got six rebounds in the game. Here's Arenas. Rebound by the Bulls. Here's Harper. Driving to the basket. And that one is hammered home. Get up there, young fella. Sometimes as a point guard, you got to take it yourself. Well, it's okay to be selfish when you can flush it like that. Well, if he's calling his own number, there's a reason for it. There you respect the decision-making from him out there. Here's Arenas. Oh, a clear Close foul down. there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. That's his first personal Well, foul. that was clearly first a foul. foul. At the line for the Wizards. Hill Arena. Two shot. And he knocks down the first one. And that's good as he hits both shots. At this point, you might as well go ahead and chalk up the points when he's at the free throw line. Pretty much automatic. Pass to Pippen. Here's Rodman. Who poked away. And here's the fast break. Here's Stevenson. For three. Hits the three-pointer. Six points for him. Oh, nice feed. On time and on target. 
Here's Rodman. Well, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. And so it looks like the Bulls will retain possession here. Let's take another look at the staunch defense during that mobile one block. Oh, now that was a block. Some much needed energy there to jumpstart them back into this game. That was a good call. The defense wasn't established. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. Wizards on D. They've led by as much as 10. Here's Harper. Give him eight. Outside Butler. Going inside. Harper pulls it in. Butler's gotten three of his nine shots to fall so far. Pass to Pippen. Elbow shot. Washington with a rebound. The third quarter has not started well. Just one of four. Come on now. Yeah. This kind of powerful finish gets guys going. Yeah, especially when it's coming from your point guard. What a flush. Yeah, great read. Calls his own number and then sends it home. Jordan. Oh, and just miss after miss right now. Yeah, starting the half here, one for five, and the offense might need an ironing out. Seems like they've lost their defensive focus here in the second half. Giving up way too much shutter. Here's Pippen. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Can't hit that one. Well, both him and the team seem to be off their game right now, and the frustration is clearly mounting Starting as the clock is winding down. And this kind of selflessness is great to see. Textbook positioning to draw the charge. Bull substitution. Steve Kerr. Three minutes gone now in the third quarter. Here's Pippen. Let's a floater go. No luck on that one. The Wizards on offense. They're rolling here. Nine unanswered. Outside Butler. And it's Washington with another. Their offense has been unstoppable. Just firing on all cylinders. I mean, this team is just dangerous. Right now, every shot that they're putting up feels like it's going in. Timeout called here. Chicago decides to talk it over. Oh, my. Their coach does not look happy, and I can guess why. Their interior defense has been struggling. No, they're not preventing them from scoring, and if you can get to a high-efficiency shot on the floor, and that's the paint, you just keep going. Here's Kukoc. Nine points in the game. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Bulls will retain possession. Basketball. From the inbound. And slam dunk by Jordan. Just great offense. The screen freeing him up for the slam. Hey, without that screen, he doesn't get a clean look at the rim. Yeah, well, he settled for the layup when you can attack the rim and rise up like that. And the Wizards with possession here. Following the bucket by the Bulls. Pass to Arenas. And the Wizards with another three. And they're plus five on the boards after that rebound. Now here's Jordan. The D's right on him. Now the Wizards in transition. Here's Daniels. Good, and Butler gets the assist. He's got nine. And a closer look here at the hustle stats for Washington. Defensively, they've played with a high energy level tonight. And all the steals we've seen, a result of that aggressiveness. Well, you add to that, their block totals tonight. They've been very feisty and active on the defensive end. And Kerr gets it to go. He's the last guy you want to leave alone on the perimeter. Here's Arenas. He's got 16. Outside Butler. To the inside. The 
shot by Jamison. No good. The Bulls on offense. It's a 13-point game. Here's Jordan. And Chicago again with a bucket. When he decides he wants to take it to the bucket, it's really hard for anyone to slow him down. Down low. Here's Jamison. And he takes it in for the layup off a very nice feed. Just so successful getting the ball inside and finding those great looks. Pass to Rodman. Jordan with it. The fader. Jamison grabs the board. And Washington with possession. They're on an 18-7 run. And he jams it after taking the nice feed on the run. And he's now got the double-double. Attacking the rim with power. Tremendous finish. Here's Kukoc. Nine points in the game. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they've rebounded the ball tremendously well. Outside Butler. It's not going to go for him. Some solid defense from Jordan. To the wing on the left. Driving inside. And Kerr gets it to go. He's got 10. He's done everything he can tonight. Trying to keep this team competitive. Pass to Butler. Here's Haywood. To the paint. Here's Arenas. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. That's his first personal foul. Yeah, I think we're all foul. giving more attention to health and well-being. Grant, anything the league can do better to protect player health? Well, I know they've tried to cut down on travel and minimize back-to-back, -back, but at the end of the day, you're playing 41 road games and 41 home games. That's what it is. It's a marathon. It's going to be hard, and it's an endurance race. And so, yeah, maybe reducing regular season games, but I'm not sure that's an option. So sometimes you just got to grind it out and get through it and hope for the best for your ball throw. First free throw is good. The Wizards making a switch here. Thomas has checked in. Both shots good from the strike. And here's Jordan. 19 points in the game. Pass to Kerr. Rebound by the Wizards. Here's Arenas. He's got 18. Here's Daniels. The free ball. Arena's shot is off. And you just can't afford to give up that kind of look very often. Here's Rodman. Got a hand on it. And a fast break now for the Wizards. Here's Arena's. Inside. Here's Thomas. Goes back up. No good there. And it's Chicago the other way. Tipped away. And a fast break now for the Wizards. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. That's his first personal foul. It felt like he was a little hesitant in the first half. But really, he's amping himself up here for the and battering around to get himself to the free throw line. Arena. Two shots. Two shots. <laughs> First free throw is good.
And good on the second, so he makes them both. Yeah, they've really made a concerted effort to get to the line here in the second half. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. Timeout called here. Chicago decides to talk it over. Coach is not happy with their effort on the defensive glass. They're giving up way too many second chance points. Here's Kerr. Ten points for him. Now here's Jordan. The 11-footer. Washington with a rebound. Thomas has got rebound number seven tonight. Here's Butler. That's bucket number five. He's five for 12 now. And trust me, when the D's slow to react, he'll be the first guy to make them pay. Well, I know they don't have mobile devices out there for texting, so they might as well talk to one another. Here's Pippen. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. You have to credit their effort. I mean, they've done an amazing job on the glass. Wow. I'll tell you, such an advantage having a playmaker who can get up to the rim and finish. Now that is what every team wants. Like to see that assertiveness, especially from the guy who's going to orchestrate your offense. Here's Pippen following the bucket by the Wizards. Pass to Kukoc. Clock at six. The Bulls need to get off a shot. Count that bucket. Michael Jordan's Gordon. got six here in the quarter. That's pretty unselfish there. He sees that there's a better shot on the perimeter, and bang, just kicks it out. Here's Daniels, covered by Jordan. Daniels, that one's true. <laughs> They're just taking what the defense gives them. And right now, that's the interior. Pass to Kerr. Here's Jordan. Ooh, a little luck that time as it drops. Jordan's got 23. Here are the Wizards now with the ball. They're on a 14 to 6 run. Two minutes. Two minutes remaining in the third quarter. 157 left in the third quarter. Pass to Daniels. Just five on the clock. Snaps the way. Here's Kerr. Here's Rodman. The rebound by Haywood. They are blowing this one open. Maybe the only question is how big will this lead grow? And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. his first personal foul. Fourth team foul. At the line for Washington. Kerr Butler. At the line. For two. two. That free throw misses. So both teams changing it up here. Good on the second one. And so here is Chicago. Pass to Pippen. Knocks it loose. And a fast break now for the Wizards. Here's Thomas. Here's Stevenson. He's got six. Six on the shot clock. And the three-pointer goes. Nine points in the game. And when it comes to the three, they've been really dialed in here in the second half. Pass to Kerr. Here's Kukoc. Over Butler. Kukoc, no good. And here's Washington. They're on an 18-6 run. The shot by Butler. No good. Chicago with the ball. Looking to end this cold spell. It's tipped. Four seconds separating the shot and game clocks. 
Stevenson, no good. Yeah, just hold for the last shot. Don't give them another possession at all. And hopefully that's what they'll do here. It's what most teams try to execute at this time in the game. Here's Pippen. Here's an eight-footer. And that's not going to go. And so it's the Washington Wizards with plenty of breathing room. 23 points to end the quarter. And their defense has stood out, wreaking havoc for the opposition. We'll be right back after this word. And while we have a chance, let's go to our State Farm assist of the game. You can count on him to deliver a few assists like this one each and every night. Sometimes it happens when the offense is struggling, but now and then this helps with the offensive uptick right there. Great job of setting his teammate up. And one quarter to go in a game that, to this point, has not been an evenly fought contest. Here's Arenas. Outside Butler. The three is up. Sends it home from three-point land. Uh, he can be just lethal from the perimeter. Even though he didn't get good looks in the first quarter, will that make right there? That can change things. And for Chicago, here's Kukoc. Tipped away. Out of bounds. It'll be Washington's ball. Washington basketball. Coming on to the floor for the Bulls. Here's Mason. Pass to Smith. Here's Stevenson. There's the three. Burrell pulls it in. I've been in this position. Your team is up. You want to drive in the dagger. He may be a little overeager. And some have said the pandemic increased the league's interest in a potential expansion. Grant, is that something you'd like to see? You know, I wouldn't mind that at all. I mean, it just speaks to the league continuing to be popular and continuing to grow throughout the world. So we all know there'd be a hefty expansion fee, but there's some great markets out there that love the game of basketball and would really embrace the team. You know, one city that comes to mind, Seattle. So maybe it'll happen. I'm hoping it does. Here's Stevenson. Throws it up high. We've gone about a minute and a half into this fourth quarter. Here's Harper. Pass to Burrell. Here's Harper. Just five to shoot. There's the drive. Here's Bushler. Fades. And the shot falls short that time. Well, if you believe in the numbers, that mid-range shot is not a high-value shot, even with little or no defense on you. Mason with the bucket. Kind of like playing in the rec league, little to no defense on that possession, and the easiest three-pointer you can imagine. Here's Harper. Pass to Simpkins. Got a piece of it. And a fast break now for the Wizards. And that was just moving the ball quickly. And he's rewarded at the end with the high percentage. Stevens. Yeah, the defense trying to do their best to slow him down. But when he gets room like that, you got to look out. Here's Harper to end the run. It's blocked. And they recover it. Pass to Winnington. Here's Bushler. Shot clock at six. Here's Harper. And again, Chicago, no good. It's clear he's totally out of sync. The team needs to rethink its strategy around what to do with him. Chicago with the ball. Well, Brent, the NBA is looking to give back. 
It includes the formation of the National Basketball Social Justice Coalition to address racial and social inequality. And I love that Adam Silver put together these type of committees to continue to address these concerns and not letting them go by the wayside or be forgotten. We're looking at education, we're looking at voting access, we're looking at criminal justice reform, all doing important work and it will continue. So between the players and the commissioner's office, the league doing a great job of keeping it at the forefront. Mason, the three-pointer off the mark. Chicago with the ball. Here's Bushler, pass to Burrell. And we're gonna have a jump ball. Oh, they get a hand on it. Washington with the ball. To the middle. And that one is stuffed right through. Whoa. Not a lot of resistance from the deep. That's the last guy you want to leave open. Well, not that wide open. You're given a juicy gift by the defense. You got to sink your teeth into it. Here's Harper. Comes up empty down low. Just cannot get anything to go if there's going to be a way to get out of this hole. I don't think he'll be the one to do it. Pass to Jamison. Here's Mason. Smith left side. Here's Mason. Down to five on the shot clock. Davis from long range. Rebound by the Bulls. Here's Harper. On the take. Stevenson with a rebound. He's been off the mark, and that hasn't helped them chip away at the lead. It's been a theme here this quarter. And down it goes. Two points. Davis has got four points in the quarter. Looks like we're starting to see a pattern here. Not afraid to get in the paint and get wet. Here's Harper. Off with the layup. Yeah, he's really scrambling to keep them in this game. Gotta respect that hustle. Inside. Here's Stevenson. That's good. And now he's 5 for 11 in this one. They have no answer defensively inside. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. Here's Burrell. Pass to Harper. Here's Simpkins. Checked by Davis. His first shot coming late. Stevenson with a rebound. Here's Washington now. They've only given up five points here in the fourth. Here's Mason. Smith outside. Here's Jamison. Harper pulls it in. And Brent, you played four years at Oregon State. The new college rules allowing players to benefit from their image and likeness, you think that's a positive move? I think, B.A., it's going to find its footing. It's going to smooth itself out. But my biggest concern in the first couple years is that young men and young women that are athletes Wizards don't take foul. themselves to be bigger and than the game that they're playing and the that's opportunity that's being foul. presented to them first by the foul. university with the scholarships that they've been Shooting offered. Shooting for Chicago, Scott Burrell. Taking two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he drops the first. So it's both teams making substitutions here. And he makes both free throws. Here's Washington now. They're on a 16-7 run. A oh, nice shot by Brown. <laughs> this run has been fueled by their Matador defense. 
Here's Bushler. Pass to Brown. The West has the reputation of being more competitive, but the East is only getting stronger, Brent. Which conference you think right now is tougher? Yeah, I don't mean to upset anybody that lives east of the Mississippi, B.A., but it's the West. I mean, the West has the star power. The West is chock full of incredible teams that have been together for a while and ones that are growing. And if LeBron James is in the West, mm, probably tougher. Here's Burrell. Oh, a nice one-handed slam right there. Oh, man. Exploding to the rim. Yep, makes the simple play. Pass to Thomas. Here's Daniels. Five on the clock. Puts it up from the high post. And it's off the back of the rim. No good. Probably not the shot they had in mind. But you can't fault him. He had a clean look. The shot by Bushler. No good. Here's Brown. Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. At the line for the Wizards, John Brown. Two shots. Two, two. First one falls for him. What a job the NBA has done in terms of broadcasting, allowing fans to stream games from really any device. How have you enjoyed that, Brent? Well, it's awesome uh, working in the front office, B.A., just to be anywhere in the country or outside internationally scouting, turn on my phone, flip on a tablet, and be able to watch any game that's being played in the NBA. What a treat. And so he hits both. And so here is Chicago. Outside, Brown. Pass to Bushler. Now here's Brown. Shot clock at five. Here's Bushler from the arc. And it's Thomas with the rebound. Thomas has got ten rebounds here tonight. So active. Down low, Williams. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Williams has got his first two points. Yeah, they're holding on to the lead, but they haven't been as aggressive on the offensive boards this half. Kind of interesting. Outside, Brown. Pass to Winnington. And here is Brown. Misses off the right iron. And their physical dominance has been on display. A 10 rebound advantage is a good indicator of how this game has gone. Here's Daniels. Back to Brown. Here's Daniels. Pass to Thomas. Fires the three. Burrell pulls it in. Thomas has gone just one of six shooting so far. Two minutes. Two minutes remaining in the Here's fourth Bushler. quarter. Two minutes. Here's Wennington. Williams defending. No good. A bit long that time. Boy, this offense has been dynamic and diversified. Just everyone sharing the ball and sharing the load makes you difficult to defend. The shot's good. Just what they wanted from that possession. A quality look in tight. Pass to Burrell. Outside, Brown. Here's Wennington. Here's Simpkins. Shoots a fadeaway. Here's Brown. No good, and they can't put it into the drought. Boy, this could snowball if they continue to put up points. I can't say enough about their performance. Pass to Brown. 
baseline, Jay. And another basket for Washington. Good passing to set that up. Teamwork on display. Outside, Brown. Rebound, Washington. There's 45 seconds left in the fourth quarter here. Brown against Brown. Out to the right wing. Here's Daniels. Can't cash in the 10-footer. Outside, Brown. Pass to Willington. Smith with the rebound. Here's Daniels, defended by Brown. And so it's Washington easily grabbing this one. Boy, they were something special to watch tonight, and the crowd loving every second of it. It's always a great feeling when you play this well for your fans. This team really showed what it's capable of. And that'll do it, folks. Alongside Brent Berry, Grant Hill, and Allie LaForce, this is Brian Anderson with our entire 2K crew thanking you for watching. We'll see you next time. Have a great evening.